So this video are going to be a little different. So today is the last video in 2020. Unless there will be like a little like Christmas hello thing. That is for like 50 seconds or something like yeah on tomorrow. So that will be awesome. Uh, but um, you probably know about YouTube Rewind. Uh, I am trying to make a Falcon Rewind for today where I just... I'm just gonna like tell the store everything that's happened in 2020. It's been crazy. I've got lots of subs. I've got a lot of views. I'm also having... Yeah, I have a very uncomfortable t-shirt on me, so I'm gonna... Yeah, you know. Okay, so I'm gonna start. So, in the beginning of 2020, I'm pretty sure it was as early as in January. I uploaded my first Roblox video. My first normal Roblox video. Which was cool and all, great and all, you know. And that was... I thought I was sick. I found it so much fun. It was just a boring work at a pizza place video. I didn't have my voice then. I didn't have shown like me with a mask yet. yet. I only talked through the Roblox chat to my audience and it was very small. It was very bad Roblox video. But I found it entertaining making that, that video. And my small audience that I had like 10 subscribers back then just loved watching it. So I continued making more Roblox videos. And it came out pretty awesome. So, on my birthday actually, in February, I'm not gonna tell exact date, because I don't want you to know my birthday, but at my birthday, which was in February, I made my last like Minecraft Machinima, which is like a Minecraft animation thing, which was what I made in 2019, when I started on YouTube. Oh, sorry. Uh, I didn't find it sad at all, uh, leaving Minecraft Machinima, because that took me extremely long time. I got almost no use from it. Nobody enjoy actually enjoyed it. Yeah, it was just like bad. And after that, I had only doing Roblox. But then it came a day that in will sit in Norwegian people's mind for years, for ages, for hundreds of thousands of years. March twenty. Not no to March the twelfth. 2020 this day or actually the day before no this day we got a message on our school the coron the covid 19 situation in norway was too big so we all had to go home and do school home for two weeks they said little did we know it was going to change to two months yeah we just homeschooled for like yeah and but that time is very important for my YouTube channel. If that hadn't happened, my YouTube channel wouldn't have been there about today. I would never have met these fantastic people. Because what did I learn of being in quarantine? I learned how important my audience was. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, since I'm standing so long away from the camera, I'm taking up the voice with my phone. But that one is turning like black, so I have to like, touch it in my... So it is not gonna turn off. I'm, I'm sorry. It's just how it works. Yeah, so that's why I'm doing this. Okay, I'm gonna continue now. So because my friends live a long way, they don't live like near me at all. So I usually only meet them at school, which is the reason I have so much time to make videos because I can't really hang out with my friends. Um, so I couldn't meet them at all. Um, in Norway, we did never had like that many as you probably have like in Asia. Yeah, I've said it before, most of my audience are from Asia. Uh, so we could like meet her if we lived near together, but I couldn't since I lived so far away. And therefore, YouTube, the ab ability to talk to people that were in the same situation as me, probably, was awesome. This was when I learned that I should respond and hot the comments that got in my video. And I still do that to this day, even though now I meet my, my friends on school and after school, and yeah, you know what I mean. Um, so, also, I got a much clo much closer with YouTube. I started uploading much more often. Before, I just upload once a week, but I started changing it. So, 
Now, and now I started doing it on new way. I uploaded every day in periods, and then I took like a week break, and then I uploaded every day for a week. And after about a month of doing that, I started uploading every single little day. Which is what I does to this day, to today. Uh, so yeah, I, I started uploading every day, and all those views, all those subscribers, I just got overwhelmed about everyone that started finding my channel. I got like some really good online friends. That uh, mo actually all of them has left the channel now. They don't watch my videos anymore. But we had a great time back then. I remember. Yeah. Um. What are, yeah, now we're, I think now we're gonna open it. Yeah, or, or I might take something from like, yeah, because, um, I remember May 17, because May 17 is the Norwegian National Day, and we actually celebrated that kind of normal, so I met my friends there, and that was pretty awesome, and I didn't upload a video that day, because I hang out with my friends, uh, because that was the only day I was able to do it, and we had fun, so, yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna pick that up, but now we're like in June, so the school opened again Because now the corona weren't that serious anymore, so the school opened again I could meet my friends, hang out with them, my time was very great But what I did, which I'm still surprised by and very happy for that day Is I continued to upload once a day, even though no, oh no Even though, yeah, okay, still working, even though today even though then I had, I still have today, even though then I had like full school days, I had homework, I wanted to hang out with my friends, but I still managed to push out a new video every single day, which I'm pretty amazed by, and find super super good. I found a way I could do it. And then it became summer, I took a break from YouTube, just like I'm going to do now because it's Christmas. Um, so, yeah, uh... And I come back, I had lost like my audience because they they had like left me. As I told the audience I had back then, I kind of left me and I had found a new one. So I recorded like for a month without audience and like that was like... And in September, I don't remember exactly when. Uh, I, I think it was then Isaac. You know Isaac, he is one of them that watches today. You probably have seen it in the comments before. Uh, yeah, I'm talking directly to you. That was when you came to me and found me and started watching me. I think you have been watching for so much as four months. I don't really know. That has been crazy, you know. Um, But then I started growing a new uh, audience. I found Galilea Rodriguez. I hope I pronounced it right. I'm not that good at like those names. Uh, More people started coming. I started getting... It ton of views, I started getting a ton of subscribers and now we are at December, today, this day I know I skipped like a ton of parts but I don't want to make this video too long so I skipped a lot of stuff um, I know this was a different video, uh, I know this probably was not funny, it was kind of emotional maybe um, but that's, tw I just want to make like a perfect rewind and go through all the important stuff that has happened since January to December in 2020. I'm hoping for that 2021 will be better, not only for my YouTube channel, but for the world. Um, but I feel like with all that has happened, all that changed on my channel in 2020, I'm looking forward to 2021. I have so many ideas, I can't wait to get started okay this video has felt very weird but this is actually fun to make just talking um i hope you got a little because the ones that has watched me now came in like september so they haven't seen like the full stuff that has happened this year so so uh Hope you enjoy this, hope you find it like not entertaining but you can feel it a little with me why I make this video because I want to like get like a reminder of everything that literally happened in 2020. It's been so big for like my channel. I wouldn't be at 161 subscribers if this didn't happen. I would probably be at more like 15. 
You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know how to end this video. Uh, if you want to join another adventure, uh, subscribe so you can... No. <laughs>